All right, welcome to the uh, WWE 2K20 Raw Rumble Sweepstake Draw. As you see, got two boxes here, participants and wrestlers. Um, hopefully you're watching this video because you've uh, entered. Uh, if so, congratulations. This is the inaugural uh, virtual Raw Rumble sweepstake. Um, there are 30, 30 names in there. Some of them are duplicated because people bought um, more than one, which is fine, I guess. And there's 40 wrestlers in there. So there's going to be 10, that, 10 wrestlers that are going to be missing out. Um, what I, you will notice that the video, the original video, I did say there's going to be three, and I was going to draw a number out. I figured it'd be a bit more exciting if I made it random. If I made the, if I made the, you can draw your wrestler, fine. You know then who's going to be participating you, participating for you in the Royal Rumble. Um, but the number itself, I thought would be fun to be random. So on the night when we're streaming it, who knows who's going to come up? To know who's going to come up might make it a bit boring. So I figured having it, uh, having it random might make it a bit more exciting. But um, yeah, so that's what's going to happen. Um, so I'm going to draw out some names from the, the participant name first, and then the wrestler, and that's the wrestler that's going to be assigned to that particular participant for that uh, for that draw. That's all we're doing with today. Um, I've got a little laptop here, so I can note down everyone there. Um, there will be visuals as well. I will give you some, obviously, there's a lot of people who, there's probably some people who, are, who have no idea who any of these wrestlers are, maybe one or two. Um, there are, I've, I've picked older type wrestlers, um, wrestlers basically that are at least at, at wrestled sort of during the late 90s, either pre the late 90s or just around the late 90s, early 2000s. So uh, most of them are quite well known. Um, but that's, uh, that's who I've picked is obviously... Yeah, this is a trial. We don't know if it's going to work, if it's going to be any good. If it is good and it is fun and people want to do it again, fine. We'll do it with more modern wrestlers or we'll do it with other games. Like maybe, uh, I don't know, like a FIFA tournament and you can sweepstake a name. I'll put a tournament together and yeah, do that. But anyway, we'll do this for now. Um, obviously, I'm not participating. Neither is my partner. We're no, we have no vested interest in this other than just to hope it hope people have fun so let's go on with it shall we enough of this uh dilly dallying let's go on with it and draw the first number the first participant it's oh. exciting stuff the first one i didn't go through lot dozens and dozens of kinder eggs before i bought these online separately so all oh, the first one clara milligan Welcome, Clara. Uh, and the wrestler that she has drawn is. Du, 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 du. Du, du. The dog's just mirrored that by the way. See, and they just. Oh, it's a blinder for Clara. The Undertaker. The Phenom, the legend, one of the greatest professional wrestlers that has ever lived, The Undertaker. Congratulations, Clara, you've got a good one there. Make sure I write that one down. Undertaker, there's three different versions of Undertaker in the game. Uh, make sure it's the most popular one, the uh, present day one. Okay. It's fun, isn't it? We're all having fun, aren't we? Second participant. Oh, okay. Bex Chang Brown. She's actually entered five times. I think all the name of her son, Bruce. So welcome, Bruce. Uh, Bruce is a wrestling fan, but I think he's a wrestling fan of present day. So I'm hoping that some of these wrestlers don't go over his head. Oh, so it can't be the Undertaker, obviously. That's gone. And Bex's first draw. The Heartbreak Kid, Shawn Michaels. Lovely stuff. Mr. WrestleMania. Make sure that one's noted down. Sean Michaels. All right, it's good to have two Royal Rumble winners in real life in there. Michaels actually won two Royal Rumbles as well. Participant number 
number three. It's going to take a while, isn't it? Just realised. Never mind. It's all fun. Uh, Ollie Corkut. Lovely. All right, mate. Um, it's my partner's stepbrother. Oh, the Corkut's uh, wrestler will be Sting. Not off of uh, the police. Sting is um, a wrestler. M main career was in WCW. Came into WWE for a couple of matches towards the end, but yeah, Sting. I make, make sure you write that down, obviously. Where are you, Ollie? There you are, mate. Sting. Top lad. What a lovely lad he is as well, right? Lovely lad. Got a lot of time for him. Right. Number four is Ian Webber. A fellow analyst, a fellow spreadsheet enthusiast. I'm using a spreadsheet right now. I can't go a day without using a spreadsheet. Mr. Webber. He wanted Takamichinoku or anybody from Kayantai. Unfortunately, neither of the members of Kayantai are in the game, so he's going to have to make do with A.O. Scott Hall slash Razor Ramon. I'm um, probably going to choose Scott Hall because Scott Hall's a bit cooler. But uh, yeah, A.O. Congratulations, Ian. Make sure I let them down, obviously. Uh, uh, Gahal. Former member of the NWO, of course. Participant number five. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, a late entrant. Nathan Brand. Nathan, uh, self-professed, self knows nothing about wrestling. So uh, I'm going to lie and whoever he gets, just say it's really good. Say it's a good one. Thank you for entering, though, Nathan. Um, uh, okay, he gets the Million Dollar Man, Ted DiBiase. It was very good in his day, Nathan. Very good in his day, I'm not going to lie to you. Very good in his day. Um, let me just write that one down. I keep forgetting to do that. Number six. Oh, that's exciting. We're only fifth of the way through, lads. Very great fun, isn't it? Oh, it's my brother, Russ Moran. He is a big wrestling fan. I think he's probably the biggest wrestling fan we've got in this one, so he would be desperate for someone good. What have we got for him? What have we got for you, bro? What have we got for you, fella? Oh, it's not a bad one. The game, Triple H. Not a bad one, Russ, well done, mate. Great effort. It's all about the game, and I will play it. Nice one, mate. I'll put you on there. Triple H did win a Royal Rumble in 2002, I believe. So there you go. Uh, number seven. <clears throat> Who have we got now? Who have we got here? That's uh, my boy. ex bandmate, Rich White. I think he's entered a couple of times, so this is his first entrance. I just realised I put that one, that's the wrong number. Sorry, Rich, bear with me, mate. There we go, right. Uh, who have we got for you? Who have we got for you? He came around to watch WrestleMania one year. Good for him. Good lad. Good lad. Oh. Mankind. Mick Foley. Congratulations. Not bad, not bad. Obviously never never won a rumble. But two time WWE cha WWF champions. Not bad. Okay. Who have we got here? Okay. It's Ollie's girlfriend. Ella Davis. Again, I don't think she knows a huge amount about wrestling. But it's fun, it's all fun, all fun and games. She's a lovely, lovely lass. Ella Davis, what have you got today? Okay, Ella Davis, you've got everybody's favourite wrestler, X Pac. All right, yeah, suck it. All right, yeah, everyone loves X Pac, don't they? 
Good luck with that one. Um, next. Let me sure I'm down actually. Have I put main planets for straight? I did. Uh, Ella Devils, wherever you. There you are, X Pack. Sorry, Ella. What a great one, mate. Um, now, this guy I actually don't know. I've never met him, but he's entered anyway. I think Craig Dara, is that how you pronounce your name, mate? If I got it wrong, I wholeheartedly apologise. Um, I've lived a life of people pronouncing my name wrong, so. I know the pain. Craig Dower, right. Don't know if you like wrestling or not, mate. If you do, great. If you don't, then I'll just lie to you and say this was a good, good choice. Uh, next one. Oh. Andre the Giant. One of the biggest guys that's going to be entering the Rumble in this year. Andre the Giant, obviously sadly passed away but uh, he will live on in this Royal Rumble and that is a very good choice probably the biggest guy in there nice one congratulations Craig next Dan Bird right mate how are we doing Dan Bird Shuffled them just to make sure. Dan, you, my friend. Woo! Ric Flair. Yes. The Nature Boy, Ric Flair, won the 1992 Royal Rumble to win the WWF title. The WWF title was on the line in that one, so you've already got a you've got a Royal Rumble winner in your pick there, Dan. Welcome, congratulations, mate. Next, okay, it's Bex's second pick for her boy Bruce, I believe. And she has drawn, Shawn Michaels in her first one. What's her second one? She's obviously favorite to win this Bex, considering she picked five people. Okay, the legend, sadly passed away, Eddie Guerrero. Viva la raza! Nice. She's got a couple of good ones there, I think. Okay, who's next? I think we've drawn another one. We have. It's Beck Channing Brown again. Brucey. Who have you got, my boy, my friend? Who have you got? Shawn Michaels and Guerrero so far. Next. Oh, well, it's the Big Show. I was talking about Andre the Giant, Andre the Giant being one of the biggest. I think Big Show might be up there as well. Seven foot two, 500 pounds, the Big Show. Wow. I think her, I think her odds have just gone up. Gone down, what does that mean? Down or up, which is good. I don't know, I don't know, Ben. Next, okay. Sarah Tudgy. <laughs> It's not Tudgy, it's Tug Gay, but there you go. Uh, wife of uh, one, of her, one of my best buds. She sits in and watches wrestling with us sometimes, bless her. Has no idea what's going on, but she can, uh, I think she hates Seamus, and Seamus isn't in this, so don't worry about it, you're not going to get Seamus. But you are going to get legend Brett the Hitman Hart. Lovely stuff. Brett Hart did actually um, joint win a Royal Rumble, tied, I think he eliminated at the same time with Lex Luger. So well done. Uh, Brett Hart. Uh, 94 I think, I think it was a 94 Rumble. All right, next. Mm. Archie Gemmell, not that one, not the famous Scottish footballer Archie Gemmell, but Archie Gemmell, husband of a colleague of mine, Debs. She'll be drawn later on. Archie, my friend, who have we got? Who have we got here then? Some good ones being drawn so far. 
you have got, well, you've got a the name of a famous Scottish footballer there. You've drawn a supposedly Scottish wrestler in Rowdy Roddy Piper. Welcome, my friend. Um, not actually Scottish, obviously Rowdy Roddy Piper, but still. You know, it's nice to lie about these things, isn't it, WWE? Right, Archie, you've got Rowdy Roddy Piper. Passed away as well, unfortunately, as most, as a lot of wrestlers do in an early age. All right. Next, still plenty to go. Still plenty to go. There'll be a few of you who are waiting on tenterhooks to see who your wrestler is. And we have got drawn here Nathan's wife, Lara Brand. Thanks for joining us. Lara, I'm assuming if Nathan knows nothing, I'm assuming Lara knows nothing as well, but we never know. She might be a closet fan, and I've never heard about it. Lara, my friend, you have drawn <laughs> one of the worst ones in the list, I'm really sorry. Papa Shango. Papa Shango. Papa Shango had many gimmicks in the WWE, Papa Shango being one of them, or also Kam Mustafa and The Godfather. The Godfather, unfortunately, isn't in the game. Papa Shango is, I don't know why that is. So there you go, congratulations. I'm really sorry about that one, that's one of the worst ones. Um, but there you go, you never know, it might, it might work out. Papa Shango. Having a lovely time. I'm having a lovely time, lads. Having a lovely time with the lads. Next up, one of my best buds, Ben. Big Ben Shield. The Enforcer. You know what I'm talking about. Ben, my friend. He sat in and watched WrestleMania with us before. That's happened a couple of times. Ben, my friend, you have drawn another big lad. Mark Henry. But I often get confused between Ben and Mark Henry. They're very similar looking. Um, there you go. Mark Henry, he'll be up there as a favorite lad. He's an absolute unit, world's strongest man. Shoo in it, Mark Henry's gonna win this one. Unfortunately, never won a rumble in real life, but uh, who cares about that? This is virtual reality. No one cares about that. Plenty of names left in the hats, exciting stuff. Next up, it's my boy, it's Rich White's second choice. You got me around. Mankind was your first pick. Your second pick is one of my personal favorites, The Ultimate Warrior. Love it. One of my favourites, Ultimate Warrior. Absolute nutcase. Definitely had some screws loose. I share a couple of those attributes with him. The Ultimate Warrior. Never won a rumble either, but was WWF champion one time. Uh, okay, next up. So our fourth, choi fourth choice. Beck Shining Brown. Care of Bruce, I believe. Or was it the other way around? I can't remember. There we go. Bex, my friend, who have you got for your fourth choice in this virtual WWE Royal Rumble? Oh, one of my favourite wrestlers of all time. Kane! That's gotta be Kane! Love it. Well done. Big Red Machine, Kane. Well done. Lovely stuff. You've got some big, big members in there. Shawn Michaels, Guerrero, Big Show, Kane. Okay, at one point had the most uh, uh, eliminations in one Royal Rumble. Doesn't anymore. Next up, my boy, Wes Bird. Here we go, fella. What have you got for us? What have you got for us? Wes is a wrestling fan. We've sat and watched many pay-per-views together. Oh. Ha! <laughs> Kevin Nash slash Diesel. Another big lad. Probably gonna pick Kevin Nash for you, mate, because he's a bit cooler than ha! Diesel. Former WCW champion. And WF champion, actually, when he was Diesel. Uh, next up, 
So plenty of numbers left in here. Plenty of names left in here. Who we got here? Okay, okay, okay. I don't think she knows anything. Tiana. Tiana's actually another contestant's daughter. She's uh, she's entering. Uh, bless her. Welcome, Tiana. I've met her a couple of times. Uh, I hope you know who any of these people are. If you don't, don't worry. I'll just assure you that they're good. Who have you got here then? Okay. Wrestling legend. The American Dream, Dusty Rhodes. Sadly, no longer with us. Dusty Rhodes. Lovely stuff. Obviously, famously has a couple of, uh, couple of his sons wrestle. Gold Dust being one of them. And Cody Rhodes. There you go. The more you know. Oh, next up. Next up. Ben Shield's wife, Emma Shield. Uh, how she deals with Ben on a daily basis, I'm not entirely sure. But hopefully she'll win 30 quid for her efforts. And she will draw in the Royal Rumble. The immortal Hollywood Hulk Hogan. Brother. Two-time Royal Rumble winner. Of course, it's Hulk Hogan and he does what he wants, doesn't he? And, uh, only... It's a Hollywood version, even though he's in the red and yellow, but there you go. Hulk. Hogan. Nice. How many left? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine people left, nine to be drawn. I believe we've got nine in there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, yeah. Almost panicked for a second there. I thought it was gonna go catastrophically wrong. Graham Taylor. Welcome, my friend. A colleague of mine. Graham, who have you drawn? Some big names have been drawn out so far. Some big names still left to be drawn. This isn't one of them. Hulk Hogan's personal best friend, Brutus the Barber Beefcake. Uh, Graham, I'm so sorry. He was not a good wrestler in real life. And now you've drawn a virtual version of him, which I'm sure is going to do as poorly as the actual barber did in real life. Yeah, he wasn't good. He wasn't a good wrestler. But there you go. Unlucky mate. It's all virtual reality. You might win one. It might, might break against all the odds. Right, next up. Another colleague of mine from Northern Ireland, Gareth Montgomery. I believe he's got two, actually, in this Gareth, so... Still plenty of big guys left, still plenty of big guys left. Gareth, my friend, your first draw is... Vince McMahon. <laughs> this man is a Royal Rumble winner, and a, w and a former WWF champion, and a former ECW champion. Uh, so you want about Vincent Man? He has ticked a lot of boxes, and you will draw him as your first draw. He probably won't win this one, but there you go. Welcome, thank you for your draw. For that was that was your first one. Obviously, you still got one left. Who is next? Who's next? As Goldberg used to say, maybe Goldberg's in this one. Oh, who knows? And weirdly enough, Gareth, you're next up as well. Two in a row for Gareth. Vince, will he get Shane? Is Shane even in this? If he does, this is ridiculous and it's not rigged, I swear. Um, he gets, okay. Jim the Anvil Neidhart. Gareth, you've had a bit of a stinker, mate, to be honest with you. Uh, Jim the Anvil was obviously part of one of the most successful uh, dynasties in all of uh, wrestling. He was part of the Hart Foundation, uh, won the... Uh, Won the tag team belt several occasions with Bret Hart, but uh, not much of a singles competitor. But there you go, you never know. He might do it, he might do the job. Next up. Next up is, uh, in fact, Bex's last one. Bex slash Bruce, Channing Brown. Your last one, mate. 
what are we doing? You've got some very big names already. Shawn Michaels, Eddie Guerrero, Big Show, Kane. And your final one is the charismatic enigma, Jeff Hardy. Not a Royal Rumble winner. Uh, not the kind of stature you need to win a Royal Rumble, but you never know. Rey Mysterio won a Rumble once in real life. So yeah, there you go. Welcome, Jeff Hardy. One of my personal favorite wrestlers as well. And probably most people's personal favorite wrestler. Absolute high flyer legend. But did like the drugs. Uh, next up, it's another Bex, but a different Bex. You know what I'm talking about, if you are that Bex in question. It is indeed Bex Vale, Tiana's mother. Tiana, you drew Dusty Road, so let's see who Bex gets. Not many left. The big boss man. Big boss man. Yeah. Souls. Souls. Uh, yeah. Okay, and we've got left. Four left, I believe. Is that right? Yeah, four left. One person in it twice and hasn't been drawn once yet. That's strange. And he gets drawn now. Jake, so. Um, he's, he's got two entries into this. Jake, my friend, who have you drawn? You have drawn... Oh, yeah! Macho Man Randy Savage. Legend, obviously, also, sadly, no longer with us. Uh, not a Raw Rumble winner. But, uh, was, was WWF champion. And WCW champion. So, not a bad name, not a bad name to draw. And he gets his second one in a row. Jake, my friend. Match your man, was your first one. <clears throat> your second one is... Oh, the Beast Incarnate, Brock. Lesnar! You've got a couple of good ones there, my friend. I'm not going to lie to you. Brock Lesnar, a 2003 Royal Rumble winner. And also, WF champion, WE champion, several times. Only two left. Still got some big names yet to be drawn. So going a couple I'm thinking off the top of my head that I'm missing out, which I'm a bit disappointed about. Colleague Debs Gemmel. Her husband, Archie Drew, Rowdy Roddy Piper. But there's some big names still left in here. Debs, who have you got? Who have you got? I was worried about this one, I was going to be drawn. Dwayne The Rock Johnson. If you smile! Congratulations, Debs. Uh, 2000 Royal Rumble winner was The Rock. And obviously, won several titles to his name. And we've only got one left. I will do this just to make sure. Hopefully this is who I think it is. It is indeed Brad Miles. Brad, I'm not sure if you know much about wrestling, mate. Thanks for joining them. Thanks for hunting. Um, Brad, my friend, you have drawn... Ooh, okay. Ricky the Dragon Steamboat. Absolute legend, uh, legend of wrestling. And there you go. That's, uh, that's all of them. Ricky the Dragon Steamboat. That's it. That's all 30. There are some big names that have been left out, here, left out in here that haven't been drawn. I think Stone Cold Steve Austin's in here. That's everyone. Um, I'm gonna uh, cut to a list of everyone's, uh, probably just sort of maybe scrolling down there or in two blocks, I'm not sure. I have everyone's, uh, the names and who they've drawn so you know to who to look out for. Um, by all the means, by all the means, by all means, Google them. 
maybe Google their music so you know when the music hits on the stream, you'll know who your wrestler is. But yeah, so um, the, the numbers are going to be random. I figured the number, it would be much more exciting to have everyone waiting for their guy to be drawn out rather than knowing when it's going to come. So that's what's going to happen. Um, hope you've enjoyed this exciting draw of the inaugural uh, WWE 2K20 Royal Rumble sweepstake. Uh, if it's successful and people like it, then I will do other sort of sweepstakey based things and tournaments and all that sort of thing. But anyway, that's what's going to happen. That's uh, that's the end of the uh, the draw. Hope you've hope you've enjoyed it. Uh, I've got other videos as well about other stuff, mainly gaming, but some sort of tutorials on uh, on uh, what to do when you want to go to sleep. There's a great great video on that. So yeah. I hope you've enjoyed it. I'll see you when the stream happens. Um, I've got to do a couple of test streams to make sure it's all working. But when uh, when it's up and ready, I will let everyone know when it's going to happen um, ahead of time. So you've got plenty of time to uh, to um, put things aside if you need to. Or you don't have to. But there you go. And uh, there we go. I'll see you on the stream. Trusen!